verify IPv4 and IPv6 addressing. The addressing table R1, R2, R3, R1, R2, R3, PC1 and PC2. You need to complete the, the table for PC1 and PC2 configurations. Use ipconfig to verify IPv4 addressing. PC1 command prompt. PC1 command prompt. ipconfig space slash all. Okay. Fill in the addressing table with IPv4 address, subnet mask, and the default gateway. Okay. Here, IP address, IP address, subnet mask, here, and the default gateway, here. IP address 10.10.1.100, Subnet mask 255, 255, 255, 224, and the default gateway 101197. PC2 command prompt, ipconfig space slash all. PC2 command prompt, ipconfig space, ipconfig space slash all. Okay. IP address 10.10.120, 10, subnet mask 255, 255, 255, 240, default gateway 10.10.117. 10, IPv6 config to verify IPv6 addressing. PC1, IPv6 config space slash all, PC1. IPv6 config space slash all. Addressing table, fill in the addressing table with IPv6 address, subnet prefix, and the default gateway. IPv6 address, okay, this is link local IPv6 address. This starts with FEAD column column, and this is global unicast address, IPv6 address. 2001 column db8 column 1 column 1 column column a prefix uh, 64 and the default gateway fead column column 1 on pc2 the same process click on pc2 command prompt and space repeat the command but here at ipv6 config space slash all enter and now you can add on the table or you can see the link local IPv6 address, the IPv6 address 2001 db 1 column 4, column, column A, prefix 64, and the default gateway FEAD, column, column 3. Task connectivity using ping. Use ping to verify IPv4 connectivity from PC1, ping, IPv4 address of PC2. Okay. Go to PC1, ping, and what is the uh, ping from PC1 to PC2? What is the IPv4 address of PC2? PC2, IPv4 address is 10.10.120. And go to PC1, 10.10.120. Was the result successful? Yes, success. From PC2, ping IPv4 address of PC1. Okay, go to PC2, ping space, click on PC1 and verify the IPv4 address 10101100. 10, go to PC2, 10101100. 10, success. Was the result successful? Yes. 
this pin to verify IPv6 connectivity. Okay, the same process but using IPv6. So go to PC1 and ping. Click on PC2 to verify IPv6 address. To 001 db 814 colon colon okay do not use link local okay okay because link local address is uh, only relevant on the local link okay and use ipv6 address to 001 db 814 colon colon a 2001 db8 column 1 column 4 column column a enter was the result successful yes from pc2 ping ipv6 others of pc1 go to pc2 ping space go to pc1 verify the ipv6 address global unicast address 2001 db8 one one column column a 2001 db8 one one column column a enter success was the result successful yes discover the path by tracing the route use tracer from pc1 trace the route to pc2 okay Go to PC1 and use the tracer command and IP, uh, IP address of PC2. Okay. Tracer IP address of PC2 10 10 120. 1, 1, 2, 3, 4 hops. Okay. 1, 2, 3, four hops what addresses were encountered along the path 10 10 1 97 10 10 1 5 10 10 1 10 and 10 10 1 20. 10 10 1 and 97 is the gigabit 00, 0 on r1 this interface this interface gigabit 00, 0 on r1 10, 10, 1, 5 is the serial interface on serial 0, 0, 0 interface on R2. 10, 10, 1, 5. Okay, this, this serial 0, 0, 0 on R2. And 10, 10, 1, 10. 10, 10, 1, 10, serial 0, 0, 1 on R3. Serial 001 on R3. And finally, PC2. Okay, PC2. Very nice. With which interfaces are the four addresses associated? Okay. G uh, Gigabit 00 on R1, serial 000 on R2, serial 001 on R3, NIC on PC2. Okay, from PC2, trace the route to PC1. Okay, go to PC2, trace our and use the IPv4 address of PC1. Go to PC1 to verify this uh, IP. 10, 10, 1, 100. 10, 10, 1, 100. Enter. Okay, four, uh, four hops. 1, 2, 3, and PC1, 4. What addresses were encountered along the path? 10, 10, 1, 17, 10, 10, 1, 9, 10, 10, 1, 6, and 10, 10, 1, 100. With which 
interfaces are the four addresses associated 10, 10, 1, 17. 10, 10, 1, 17. Gigabit 0, 0 on R3. 10, 10, 1, 9. 10, 10, 1, 9. Serial 0, 0, 1 on R2. 10, 10, 1, 6. 10, 10, 1, 6. Serial 0, 0, 1 on R1. And 10, 10, 1, 100. NIC interface on PC1. Okay, this interface gigabit zero zero on R three. This another serial zero zero one on R two. This another serial zero zero one R one and PC one. Very good. Okay. Use tracer to discover the IPv6 path. Okay, the same process, but using IPv6. Go to PC1. Okay, repeat the command with ping to PC2, but um, instead of using ping, use tracer. Okay, on PC1, on PC1, tracer the IPv6 address of PC2, 2001db814, column, column. And what addresses were encountered along the path to zero zero one db eight one one column column one two column column one three column column two and four column column eight with which interfaces are the four addresses associated okay one one column column one Okay, this is gigabit zero zero on R one. One two column column one. This serial zero 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 on R two. Is this serial zero zero on R two? One three column column two. One three column column two. Serial zero zero one on R three. Serial zero zero one on R three. And one four column column A. The nick on PC two. Finally, from PC2, trace the route to the IPv6 address for PC1. Okay, go to PC2, click here. Repeat the command when you ping uh, IPv6. But use tracer, tracer, the IPv6 address of PC1. 2001db811a, enter, success. The IP addresses 2001db814 colon colon 1, 13 colon colon 1, 12 colon colon 2, 11 colon colon A. Which interfaces are the four addresses associated? Okay, 14 colon colon 1, 14 colon colon 1 is this uh, gigabit 00 on R3, gigabit 00 on R3, this interface. One three column column one, one three column column one, serial zero zero one on R two, serial zero zero one on R two, one two column column two, one two column column two, serial zero zero one on R one, serial zero zero one on R one, and finally. 
one one colon colon may the NIC interface on PC one. NIC interface on PC one. 